Now, I knew that it was just a matter of time before Narinda Kaur would overstep the mark, and lo and behold, she has. Of course, it was Remembrance Sunday, and uh, Catherine made an appearance on the balcony. And you know, in my own personal opinion, considering what she's been through, she looked all right. She looked well. Now, it wasn't cancer that Catherine had. She was told she had precancerous cells, and I've been told this is just as bad as being told you have cancer. It's a, it's a terrible thing to learn. So, of course, it would affect anyone, wouldn't it, including Catherine and royalty. And so she started immediate treatment for that, and by what I've seen online, it's been successful, and thankfully she's, she's pulled through. So anyway, enter Narinda Kaur. And she posted something rather horrific on social media. And considering she's meant to be this big social commentator and she pops onto all the uh, GB News talk radio shows to give her vacuous and quite racist, hateful opinions, you'd think she'd be abreast with all the news when she said this. And I quote, Genuine question, why has Kate aged so much? Isn't she only 42? Is she a smoker? It's the only explanation, end quote. Now, she's deleted this because of the rightful backlash, and there's been a huge backlash. And not only did this idiot not apologise, she doubled down. And then, of course, she pulled the race card. And that apology, it really wasn't an apology. I think she knew full well. I mean, who doesn't know that Catherine didn't go through all that? I mean, it's not like Kate or Catherine was posting photos of herself drinking alcohol while telling people she was in the middle of chemotherapy, is it? But no, Narinda Kaur never brings any intelligent or mature argument and debate whenever she appears on television for interviews. It's always blame whitey and idiotic hatred and just something to shock and make herself newsworthy. But seeing her meltdown and uh, trying again to apologise by not apologising, it's quite amusing. And hopefully this particular overstepping the mark and going too far and the backlash it's garnered will completely put her off putting a mug on telly just to get more attention. And there we go. I'm past 49. Thanks for watching. And until the next time, Roger Trout.